the belts on. She's running sweet. Gonna put some air in the tires. We're pretty much ready to go. Scottish weather down there to see us off. Jesus. But There's gonna be plenty more where we're going. Is that, right? You said we have to do a good job. Is that is that all right? I'm happy with that, mate. Yeah, that's, that's all right. right. We've got the all clear, Scott. All right. To Scotland. What's it driving like, Scotty? It's driving great. I'm gonna keep it around the 55 mark just to keep it chill. We don't want to over rev this old engine. The tracking's a little bit out, a bit cockeyed. It's just humming along. It sounds like a hairdryer. It's armrest down. Chilling. I think I could have been a taxi driver in another life. You are a taxi driver now. Electronic key fob seems to be stuck in the open position. If we were to lock it from the inside and get out, we connect the key. It's locked now, right? Unlock. Oh, I see. There is no locking function. So to lock those doors, booty first into the footwell. The odd socks on, dude. Slide on out of the bottom bunk. <laughs> God damn. So no locky then. Are all the doors locked now? Like a Lara Croft adventure. You gotta make sure the keys are in the right puzzle. Okay, so it does lock. Nice. We cruising, baby. 35 all the way. She's slow, but she's definitely comfortable to drive. I could sit here all day. Bill. Are you hungry? Seems like we're in the northeast. Shall we feast upon a local cuisine? Do a left. It's not generally on the athlete's diet, this one. You gotta stop by and eat the local stuff. And like, this London taxi's come all the way to best kebab. 290 miles for a palmo. But I'll tell you what, people have traveled further distance for a less delicious dish. Enjoy. Great, thank you so much. How many bites can you have before your heart stops? This is the question. So. That looks like a pizza, but then you're saying that's just chicken and cheese. It's a butterflied breadcrumbed chicken breast that's then deep fried, then put into like a pizza dish with bechamel sauce and cheese on top and baked for a little while. I mean, what can you say? It tastes delicious. It's no athlete food, is it? Arteries constricting with each mouthful. <laughs> So we've done another couple of hours driving up past Darlington. I think we've had enough. We're going to stop, get some shut eye and finish the drive up to Scotland tomorrow. I hopefully stop in at the loading bay for a skate. I'm excited for the first night sleep in the, uh, in the luxury, in the luxury of calm. Taxi camper van. I'm down there. It looks ghetto, but we're going to be comfy. We've got these two really nice, um, Sleeping bags. It's warm in here, but it won't be with the right, engine on. Check. We'll be waking up and it'll be about two degrees. I'm gonna brush my teeth and then get into bed. It's good night. It's good night from us. Oh, don't fart in the sleeping bag. <laughs> that's, a, that's a bad idea. Good night. Got my snowboard here, just to keep me inspired. I don't got my shades. There's loads of room. How are you feeling? It's not bad at all, really, is it? The sleeping bag's already warming up loads. I'm like boiling. And boiling a bag? <laughs> Man's like, rice that ball in a bag. <laughs> oh, stop farting in the bag! <laughs> right, good night, Scott. Good night, Bill. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> How was that? That was actually pretty good. Got like six hours sleep. I have some breakfast then. Back to the bag. Yeah, you could. <laughs> Look at the turning circle on this bad boy. It's actually a three-pointer on a single lane. See ya! Scotty, wait! Hop in. Where are we going? Another four or five hours up, up now. And then off to the loading bay in Glasgow. You know when people say I slept funny? Certainly funny sleeping in the taxi. I thought I was gonna at least have like a crink of a neck. I feel like I've been to the chiropractor. <laughs> right, on to Scotland. We're going 60 miles an hour, boys! Got 180 miles left to Glasgow. <laughs> this is exciting. <laughs> it just it just got real. Oh the weather boy! It's a coming down! Oh no, it doesn't slow down. What's that? 16th century castle. If it's snowing like that up the top, there's gonna be some nice snow up there, mate. A bit worried about the balance of wanting it to snow and being able to get there in the taxi. I'm sure we'll get there, right? I'm charged and ready to skate. 
we are arriving at the loading bay. Very excited to sleep here for like. Let me call Hamish McKnight. I'll be there in three minutes. Alright, you have reached your destination. Loading bay skate park. <laughs> Taxi! Hello! Wow. <laughs> How do I get up there here? Jump as high as you can and then go one bounce and straight up. Forward and straight up? Yeah. That's it, that's it, perfect. Oh. Man, that was decent! You're not so old after all. It's been a while since I've been on a super track. Hi. Teach me one of those when you like. Something that's within my level. One of them. Best well, I'm ever. definitely not going to give it a go. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, one more time so I can see the mechanics. There's no way I can do that, surely. Yeah. It's basically a roly poly. <laughs> but not bad. Just got to get your weight on the back. I know you got to go backwards, but it's not. Go like this. I have more chance of doing that. I'm not just like whip myself fully backwards. <laughs> Absolutely, you can do that, mate. It's not gonna happen. So, what's the challenge? From the platform. What are you doing up there, mate? No! <laughs> Scary. I think I pulled everything. Oh, oh for fuck's sake! Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 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 Did you land on your head? <laughs> Is this definitely possible? Then straight up, and I'll. I'll... Yeah. Ready, go. An MBD. Thank you. The key to the city. Key to the city. The best city on earth. <laughs> well, we were going to stay kind of outside at the skate park and wait for the morning so we can skate. But John, the manager, he's left a key so we can get in and hang out at least somewhere a little bit warmer than the taxi. We could use this light. Should be alright. Hell yeah. Sick. Look how spooky that is. We're we just gonna have to roll about with no lights. We go and get those fairy lights from the taxi. I can't believe they've just let us in here at night. <laughs> I can't see! Oh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, good effort, mate. God, Red Bull fridge is empty. Gonna have to pick some up from the petty. What are you doing, Scott? Look at this. I'm like a Christmas tree. Oh, let's see it then. <laughs> Yes! Wave your arms! Yeah, yeah, stick your arms out! Like, yeah, 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 yeah! <laughs> Should we go to the trampoline? A double backflip in the dark? <laughs> yeah! Yeah! 
<laughs> yes. Well, I'm gonna rip the double out of that, really. No way. Yeah. Are you okay? You disappeared. <laughs> Where are you? That was really, really scary. That was so funny. It's so horrible bouncing around with stuff all over you. It looked great though. Extra. And trampoline's scary enough when you can see. Hey, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy. Do it back in. No. Sick. Oh no! Are you alright? I didn't even I didn't even see ground, I just sensed it across my top lip. <laughs> right, that's too much fun for one night. I feel bruised. Well that's that. What a brilliant night. Time to hit the hay. They they looked way better on you when you were doing a backflip on the trampoline, mate. So far. Who gets to do that? I don't know. Uh, that's it, night night. See you in the morning. Night. Good morning. Morning, Scott. <sighs> the wind was battering the side of the taxi. <laughs> there was some funny, funny footage last night. Last night was really fun. So super sick stop off at the loading bay. Way more than we bargained for, private sessions and night skate. Off to Aviemore, four hour drive. Five hours on the scenic, let's take our time. Mate, who does that, that that's, that's pretty special. To turn up to the skate park and be like, ah, take the keys for the evening, boys. Thanks, John. Thanks. It's looking proper Scottish now. Stop in to let the traffic pass, because our mobile is the snail on the road. It's just too sluggish. There's actual snow on the road. God, I'm starting to get excited. We're gonna get shredded, bruh. We're actually gonna get some barrels, man. This is gonna be sick. It looks like Colorado. It looks like when you're driving to Copper. That is Copper Mountain, pretty much. Where's Ellis Brigham? Hey, hey guys. guys, how's it going? All right, yourselves? So, Thanks for doing this. Split boards then, eh? I've never done it before. You have, right? I've faked it once. We put them on for a photo shoot and that was it. We're going up tomorrow somewhere. Okay. But we've got a guide and he's going to take us about. Cool, so we got boards, skins, crampons. Poles are touring poles. Two bags there. And in here, pair of transceivers. Okay, sick. Yeah, that's yeah. epic, thank you so much. What beers do you drink? Whatever. <laughs> Whatever, that's, Whatever. A, that's a great <laughs> answer. Literally flip, slides out, clips in place. Makes so much sense. Oh man, I'm so excited. I need to wear a big beard and become a, a proper mounted bloke. Not just a snow kid. <laughs> Brilliant, thank you. Right. Thank you so much. Thanks, dude. Alright, take it easy, guys. Right, thanks, Enjoy. mate. See you soon. We're on. Go splitboarding.